Well, happy weekly Wednesday, my friends. Welcome back. I know this video came out much later than I wanted to. Uh, but uh, as you can see from the title, this is just a kind of a BS video. <laughs> but no, it's um, mainly just I feel like I haven't done an update or a newsworthy video in a while. And so quick update. I am on the edge of being sick. Well, not being sick anymore. So I'm getting better. I have a little like kind of coughing little cough bug that exists every now and again i'm just trying to do certain things but outside of that started a new job it's been going great going to be probably difficult but that's all right i'm excited about it but yeah well i'm not doing videos for you guys and for myself yeah i have to work so and it is what it is but it's exciting and it's stuff that i like doing and pursuing career-wise um but with that so that's enough news about me it's like, I'm so fresh, so clean with just, took a shower, but I have some food right here. I'm going to eat. It's going to be wonderful, but I feel like I wanted to talk to y'all real quick. So news and updates. Um, one, sorry, I missed a scary Sunday this past Sunday. I got stuck between trying to decide on the two games that I'm going to do, uh, but I just don't know. Well, at the time, I know which one I'm doing. Uh, but at the time, I didn't know which one to do, and I spent time pursuing other things in the time that I had available for it, so my apologies there. There should have been a scary Sunday this past Sunday, and I'll make it up to you guys, and probably will be able to, but it's like the same day of November. There was uh, two Sundays I didn't do a, a scary Sunday uh, <clears throat> because it was one, I didn't start it that first Sunday, and the second one was I finished the game, and so that's the rules of scary Sunday. It's a game I'm going to be playing that obviously is scary and something I'm not used to and put myself in an environment. Also news, re ranks my office again. Something that's probably going to be a monthly, if not a once a quarter type of thing that's going to happen. It's just, it is what it is, okay? So deal with it. <clears throat> I like it. And plus I face the door, so if I'm, the door's right there, right there. Uh, before uh, my office was over here, like my setup, and so my back was actually to the door. So imagine playing a scary game with the door to your back, and especially when you're like a like a pansy or like not a very good person that deals with like scary games very well. Yeah, that's it. It, it sucks. Okay, it, it's not fun, and I don't like it. So now I see the door, but obviously the worst thing is I'm close to a window. So if there's any branches that brush up against the window, I'm definitely gonna hear it and be like. Ah! It'd make noises and stuff like that <clears throat> but it's great so yeah news there will be a scary sunday this upcoming sunday and i'm excited about it kind of because again i have to put myself in that environment immerse myself in the situation and i don't like it because it freaks me out <laughs> but anyway i know it can be good content and that's just the main thing it's kind of something variety wise i've been wanting to do <clears throat> so excited about that so that's the first yeah first news thing second news thing uh, support your bands. It's like something I will always say with my music reaction. Go support the bands you like. This is a Cabin Boy Jump Ship shirt. And I'm really happy I have it. Super great shirt. Loved it. The back is awesome. So if you can get the shirt, go get it. If you like Cabin Boy Jump Ship. Or if you just like the band. It's like there's actually no indication that this is their band. <laughs> there's nothing odd here that says Cabin Boy Jump Ship. It's just sentiments, and then on the back, it's the logo of their latest album that came out this year. <clears throat> really good band. I highly recommend it. Go watch. Go listen to it. <clears throat> um, second thing is actually a big thing, and so I'm going to not be changing anything with my channel, but I'm adding to it. So you guys may see, with because I have a bunch of playlists anyway, uh, you're going to see another one get added called Shorts. Um, so I'm going to be doing YouTube video, YouTube Shorts. It's stuff that kind of goes to my head anyway, but I'm also going to be doing TikTok. <clears throat> Make fun of me however which way you will. Just I'm going to be doing a uh, video. will go out for both shorts and TikTok. And if you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. It's just something I'm going to do and it's something I'm excited about doing because uh, the voices in my head is a wonderful thing and I intend to profit off of it because I'm tired of suffering by it. So it's going to be great. 
So, but yeah, I'm not going to have my profile and everything linked down below. Uh, my TikTok profile will be linked on the very first YouTube short video that will come out. <clears throat> now, when you ask, it's either, I don't want to set it too far because then I'll never do it because I haven't done it since. I haven't done it yet. And it's been uh, something I've been processing through for a couple of months now, if not a few. Um, just something I've been kind of like, eh, do I want to pursue this? And it's coming to the point that it's like, eh, I could do both. I could, I could do the same video for both. And so I'm excited about it. It's going to be something funny, some little quirky. I could do longer videos. I could do shorter videos. I could actually pull from my reaction stuff, but I mainly just want that to be gimmicks. It's like, I don't want, I want my YouTube channel to be the reaction stuff. I want my YouTube channel to be just opinion stuff like this. I want it to be kind of more of the longer videos and then the shorts and the TikTok videos to be more of the just kind of trendier stuff, me being dumb, me griping or complaining about whatever. And so I'm excited about it and I'm willing to share the experience with you all if you want to indulge. So excited to partake and we'll see where it goes. <clears throat> but I want to, ETA wise, I want to say a week. So the first video will probably come out next week when I've had time to reorganize everything because the current TikTok profile I have has TTV in it and I don't stream on Twitch that much anymore. If at all, uh, will later if we get to that point, but may just stream on YouTube because Twitch has a lot of weird problems that I'm not a big fan of, but it is what it is. It's a company that has to profit somehow, so I get it, <clears throat> but also obviously you get like treating your loyal, uh, the loyal employees, essentially your contract employees that are on staff. That is probably a much more higher thing forcing it but yeah we'll see so that's something that's in the works and has been in the works and something that is actually finally getting a due date and so probably going to start not probably but probably looking to aim to do it next week and so the first youtube short slash tiktok video will be next week <clears throat> now whether what it is uh it's going to be one of the million things i've thought about doing or it might be a trendy thing I'm not going to do an intro video, just going to, the first video outright is just going to be whatever stupid thing that comes to mind. So excited about it because I get to have a lot of fun with it and that's the main thing. <clears throat> so that's probably the biggest news outside of Scary Sunday. <clears throat> with that, yeah, it's great. I'm excited about all the changes, well, add additions, I should say. But it's really difficult too because I don't know the quantity of videos I'm going to be doing for YouTube Shorts and TikToks with everything else. Um... I may, it, it's just hard, especially with me trying to learn like a new job. Well, it's a similar industry I've been in. So I, if you watch videos before, know, know a little bit. I work in the IT field industry. And so here uh, with that, it's like I just went further deeper into it. Just a more, um, what's the word? Niche? Yeah. Like a, instead of just broad of what computers and asset management can be i've went deeper so like yeah for example like networking or cybersecurity. uh you guys don't even know what i do because you i don't want you to come find me so yeah but it's some some skill i'm excited about and uh excited about learning i know a basis of it but i don't know the fuller picture of it all so i'm excited to learn excited so that's the other thing too with how many videos i'm going to be putting out for youtube shorts and tiktok videos it's like i kind of want to set set a goal at like two or three a week just because they're a lot easier and i don't have to edit them i can but we'll see it's like right now i just want to focus on getting the one out and then work on the next one after that so i may set the goal as just two for next week <clears throat> or do one and then two the following week and then just weigh how that impacts in my time of day. So we'll see. It's going to be great. I'm excited and we'll see what all changes when that comes on. But with that, that is all the news and updates about my channel. Uh, I hope you guys are excited as I am. I appreciate every one of you, especially anonymous or people that have subbed or people that are not and people just returning viewers whatever you might be in regards to my channel i appreciate you and can't thank you enough for any amount of time you allow me to have i'm undeserving of it and seriously can't can't express the gratitude that i have for it and so thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you but with that <clears throat> i could talk about other things but i kind of feel like there's a like the other thing i was going to talk about was just kind of the games awards one 
it's kind of like if you know of Moist Critical or watch a lot of a lot of his stuff, he talked about it, and I, it was like the same thing for me. It was like uh, it was the first time I've been a part of something that was weird. Like you always hear about those weird, quirky things happening, but you never actually see them or a part of them. Uh, yeah, that was the first time that I was ever a part of that. And when I saw the guy, I, I, I actually thought he was a part of. Oh, fire alarm! No. <laughs> To replace the battery on that. That's fine. I can do that. But it's going to happen. So I'm going to make the short sweet because it's going to happen once or twice more before the video end of this video ends. And it's really fucking loud. So I'm sorry. But it's short. Um, anyway, yeah, the Elden Ring team or Bandai Namco um, or FromSoft, <clears throat> whatever the fuck you want to call them. Uh, yeah, as I, I didn't even realize he, the kid walked up with him until I rewatched everything from what happened. So it was very strange, very weird. I didn't like it. And I was like, it could have been worse. Yeah, it was a big mistake, big miss, uh, miss sight on the security team. But obviously, the other questions that deem from it is like, <clears throat> like, you have to ask like, how in depth was the security for getting into the venue? And I would think it would be pretty in depth. You don't have an event that gets watched by millions of people and just be like, ah, eh, we don't give a shit. Yeah, you don't do that. <clears throat> But with that, that's all I'm going to really say about it. It's like, I think the kid already came out and said that it was just a prank. Uh, I think there's obviously conspiracy theories that like read into what is happening. And, but whatever, if you want to follow down the rabbit hole, you can. But I think it's really funny just the memes that have come out of it. Like <laughs> like a, a foe is invaded, a shadow figure is invaded or the time where I forget his name, but he's hold, um, the main like creator of the game or like FromSoft uh, is holding the trophy, but his face is like screaming, I want to hit you with this. And that, it's like, I've just loved the memes that have come out of it and it, they're just spot on and great. But with that, I'm going to stop talking before my fire alarm goes off again and don't want to deal with it. But I appreciate every one of you. I hope you guys are having a great Wednesday. I hope you guys are having a great week so far. It is midweek and keep rolling. We're going to, hopefully if it's, if it's not a good week, I hope it turns around. And we'll just keep on doing what we're doing. But yeah, let me know what you're excited about. If you're excited about the TikTok videos and everything, by next week, I should have a better voice and not feel like I, it's gone or lost or coughing all the time. We'll see what happens. But yeah, I'm excited. Uh, I've been getting better. It's been two weeks since I've had all of this. So that's the worst part. But today and yesterday were kind of like highlights of like me recovering from that. So excited to get out of it finally. But anyway, thank you guys so much. I will see you guys soon in the next video, which will probably be Friday or not. If not, definitely Sunday. Uh, <clears throat> we'll just see what happens. But anyway, thank you guys. I appreciate all of you. And I will see you guys real soon. Have a great day or night. I don't know what it is. It could be whatever time. It could be butt fuck in the middle of the day. I don't fucking know. But anyway, see you guys. Peace out. Have a great time. Be safe. Be responsible. Eat food. You know the things. Keep being you. Let's do it. See you guys.